So I started adding AFib treatment to my cardiac cases from the very beginning. So I personally feel like treating AFib is worth doing because it's a big deal. Patients can have their other cardiac problems treated, but if you leave their AFib alone, they're not gonna get the maximum outcome from everything that you're trying to provide for that patient. AFib is definitely undertreated by surgeons. We have really good data that shows that less than half of patients with atrial fibrillation who come to cardiac surgeons for other problems, whether it's their bypasses or their valves, are not getting their AFib treated. I think AFib treatment is important, especially nowadays, because we have proven techniques to treat AFib effectively. So the top three things patients who have AFib get out of treatment of their AFib is number one, their symptoms get better. Number two, we can prevent strokes from happening. And number three, we can prevent heart failure in some patients as well. A surgeon who's currently not performing a maze procedure for atrial fibrillation, I think there's a lot of benefit for them to learn how to do it and incorporate it into their practice. Number one, I think that their patients will have better outcomes Another benefit for learning how to do the Cox maze for surgery for atrial fibrillation as a surgeon is there are not that many surgeons doing it. And you can become that specific referral surgeon for patients who have atrial fibrillation and other cardiac problems. But as a surgeon, when a patient comes back after having surgery for their atrial fibrillation, it feels amazing. They'll tell me that they forget what it's feels like to be in a normal sinus rhythm, that they've been in AFib for so long, that they've been tired for so long, and now that they're in a normal rhythm and they have better energy, they are so thankful, they're so appreciative, and they are some of the most satisfied patients that I get to help.